and we have with us to kick it off that that wonderful Chris Dubberwalski with Schoolhouse Restaurant and also now Serenity Restaurant and Burgers. Burger Bar. Yeah. Burger Bar. You just yeah. didn't have enough to do. So I clearly to didn't. I just keep adding more <laughs> fuel to the fire, <laughs> hoping it'll just you know burn out someday. I guess. Well, it's wonderful. <laughs> You're such an excellent cook. We love having you. you on. And so this is kind of highlighting Serenity Restaurant and Burger Bar. Absolutely. Yes, it is. Yeah. You know, uh, Which is open, open in Sedona now. Open Oak in Creek. Sedona, and we're open for Thanksgiving tomorrow. And what we do is contemplate what we do with all of our leftovers because uh -huh. we buy you know a thousand pounds of turkey to get through the day and a couple other things yeah, you, you have know. like so 300 people coming over 300 I was as moaning because I have 20 yeah <laughs> yeah you know 20 is okay I could do 20 pretty easily you well, know? We come to my house. <laughs> okay yeah, so pretty easy so we're just <laughs> you, gonna you show do that quick. with the restaurant there's kind right. of a recycling you know to make it work you have to you have to constantly dovetail your products and you know you don't want to throw stuff out right. I mean that's your margins are pretty small in restaurants so you got to make sure that you use it up so we're gonna do two quick little options today that are very very healthy and hearty for the winter uh, one is going to be a salad and the other one's going to be a green chili chicken I'm going to put the green chili chicken Ooh. on and you know okay. this is just a chicken broth from okay. the grocery store from the market with also roasted chilies from the market so oh. you're not going to spend all day cooking in the kitchen again like you would um, <laughs> on Thanksgiving so well I um, know you're professional but you put this together in about 10 minutes of course you had all the that ingredients was 10 ready minutes. that was 10 minutes or less I believe so, <laughs> so this is a really encouraging for right. me hey I can do this in a so short amount of time. this is just some of the canned roasted chilies from La Canasta a little bit of Swanson's chicken broth okay. and we're using a smoked turkey in here so ah. you know it's so it already has all these individual flavors because you've gonna, already roasted the turkey for this. It's already smoked and yeah. roasted and all that good stuff. And then we're going to take some of the leftover too, and we're going to make a little quick salad on the side of it too. Oh, so okay. you can have you can have your pick. You can do the the turkey green chili, or you can do that one over there. So or both. Good or heavens. both. You yeah, know, you I'm can get them this. both in there and really really enjoy. And it. you've got avocados and it looks yeah. like heritage tomatoes. Those yeah. are beautiful. Yeah, we have some heirloom tomatoes in there. We have avocados, which I'm going to scoop out in a second. Some heirloom carrots and some of the organic greens. Okay. And we're going to use a white balsamic shallot dressing, which we actually use at the uh, restaurant. But do you sell that? We like do. On the side? We make <laughs> ours from scratch. I was in a hurry, so kind of bought it from the store this morning. I had to cheat <laughs> you a little. Didn't even have to tell us that. <laughs> <laughs> but we're going to use a little bit of fresh raspberries to lighten it up okay, and add some more fruit flavor to it because honestly turkey's uh -huh. pretty dry the day of and worse the day after. So uh, thank you. Glad to hear <laughs> you we're going to keep that. adding juicy <laughs> items to it and things that can add creaminess to it which would be the avocado, the dressing, the tomato and everything else. Ah, you so, diced all that avocado up ahead of time. I did, I kind of, you know, I keep oh, cutting so those nice. corners real fast, so. Ooh, and then you massage it as I had you a guest You massage the lettuce, the other day. nice and, <laughs> 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 I don't know if massaging is the term because you don't want to break it up and like what you would do with a full-blown massage, but. So you just, you just, just toss it, it nicely, up. make sure that it's covered evenly and everything is nicely coated and then we're just going to put it on the plate. Now I'm surprised that that fruit goes so well with the vegetables. You know fruit and veggies go great and if you're like me you don't like a ton of sweetness or unnaturally sweet products in your food so a vegetable or a fruit can add that little sweetness that you need or oh, that you're looking okay. for. Well, without you always having make, those refined sugars and all that other And weird you stuff. also at your restaurants, you know, you really have, besides fresh foods, they're very natural. Everything know? is organic that we use. Everything is all natural. You know, we really go out there and do some incredible things. Um, probably be more so than a lot of people within the Verde Valley. <laughs> <laughs> right. But well, that's where you're looking. Other is restaurants. There's Oak Creek and right. uh, that so, area. There's so. a quick salad. That is gorgeous. It smells really delicious too, Chris, <laughs> I have to say. And the then, smell is so much of what we eat as well. It is. Visual, it's, it's visual smell. and smell more than anything. Yeah. Um, and then green chili, of course, we're doing this quickly, but if you let sure. this boil for about 30 or 40 minutes, the turkey would break down and you'd have this incredible so you know, it would get kind of piece, yeah. you know, little... Yeah, it would come uh, PC and look sure. really, really nice. But we took some... This is so easy. I really think I can do this, Chris. You totally can. I know you can. <laughs> I, I, have, I have the utmost faith. <laughs> Thank you. And what kind of beans are these? These just are just a roasted green chili bean as well. Um, okay. Uh, roasted green chili bean. You can right. buy those in the store, I guess. Huh? And this is going to be real, real hearty look for everybody. That. So it's kind mm. of a... What is this? Like it's a like soup. a stew. Oh, a stew. Um, 
Like I said, if you cook this down a little bit longer, it'll turn out much nicer. Well, you know what I like about this? You don't have to strip the turkey down necessarily. No, right? it'll, it'll cook itself out. And then we're going to use a little bit of farm cheese, which is a Mexican farm cheese, or more like a cotija. Okay. Would a goat cheese, something like that, work too? Goat the cheese Mexican would work perfectly, is, actually. With the beans and the chili, you kind of get that. Right. So that and then a little bit of a pico okay. de gallo for some color. Oh, my and gosh. Now, what is that magic stuff? This is avocado salsa. Oh. So that's going to add just a little bit of that creaminess that we were looking well, for. Well, I'm sure you make that. Can I buy yep. this? <laughs> <laughs> we sure do. And then we'll take a little quick avocado for a for a garnish a real garnish. quick. garnish, how charming. And the last one. Oh, I bet that's so good. Well, I love the uh, the whole Mexican theme to that because it's so different than what you think of as Thanksgiving. You know, we're big fans of that kind of food here in the Southwest. Absolutely, and it gets rid of that dry turkey that we all know everybody has. So. I know. <laughs> Again, so this is, this is really a big, hearty stew because yeah. it's not Simple. got as much liquid in it. No, it's not. So. It should be very stew-like and have all the big proteins from the, the the beans, the turkey, you have the pico, you have all these other sauces in there to kind of moisten it up and make it look alive. Okay, alive that too. is amazing. I don't know, right. do you think these up yourself? I mean, you, you I thought this up on the way here this morning. <laughs> you did not. <laughs> I, I did. I was driving and, well, you know, I was late. You know what? So. That's why you are a cook and I yeah. am not. Because you actually can think, I would never in a million years think of that. Now, if you show me how to do it like you just right. did, then I think, okay, I can do that because I can picture it. I think, it's okay, really I simple. Get, it is. It just really put is. Put those items on your grocery list. So we have, we have the beans and we have the... You know, the Mexican cheese, what do right. you call this? This is cotija or farm cheese. Okay, farm and, cheese. You know, this is great for your Black Friday, too, in the mid afternoon of you, if you're out shopping and doing all that stuff, you have a nice hearty meal and uh, really break up your yeah, day. Yeah, easy to, f I mean, you can get this out to a lot of people in a short amount of time. Very quickly, and it's a great use right. of that leftover product from. And you know, it's going to be chilly here. I mean, it's it cold. Is, it's much it's colder cold. here than it is yeah. in Cottonwood today. So. Yeah, so we're <laughs> looking for really hearty. Anyway, right. absolutely beautiful. A gorgeous salad. What did you call your salad? This is just a smoked a turkey salad. salad. Smoked yeah, smoked turkey, turkey salad. salad. Okay. <laughs> and a wonderful hearty stew as well with leftovers right. from Thanksgiving. Absolutely. Chris, your miracle. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. I really appreciate wow. it. Wow. The tips are invaluable. <laughs> mm, can't wait to taste it. All